Welcome to the CTTP training videos. RDOT 460 Solvent Washing and Sieve Analysis of Asphalt Concrete. Record the percent binder content from RDOT 449, the determination of asphalt content of asphalt mixtures by the nuclear method. Reduce the sample to meet the minimum sample size requirements. Cool the sample to approximately 200 degrees Fahrenheit. Zero a sample container on the scale. Reduce the asphalt mixture to meet the minimum sample size requirements and place it into the sample container. Place the container on the scale platform and record the sample weight. Cover the sample with an RDOT approved biodegradable solvent. Stir the mixture with the spoon and allow it to soak for about 10 to 15 minutes, stirring occasionally. Pour the solvent from the container over a nested number 8 cover sieve and a number 200 wash sieve. Catch what goes through the number 200 sieve in a bucket or container. Avoid the transfer of coarse particles to the sieve. Cover the sample with fresh solvent. Stir and allow a short soaking time. Pour the solvent from the container over the sieve stack. Repeat washing with fresh solvent until the solvent maintains its original color. When the aggregate is free of asphalt coatings, drain as much solvent from the sample container as possible. Return any material retained on the sieves to the sample container. Wash the sample with water to remove the solvent residue. Cover the sample with water. Liquid detergent may be used to help remove the residue. Stir the sample. Pour the wash water over the sieve stack. Continue washing until all solvent residue is removed and the water stays clear. Rinse the spoon over the sieve stack. Rinse the cover sieve and remove any retained aggregate, returning it to the sample container. Rinse the number 200 wash sieve and return any retained material to the sample container. Dry the sample to a constant weight. Cool the sample and record the dry weight after wash. To calculate the total weight of aggregate before wash, multiply the recorded sample weight by the percent stone in the mix and divide by 100. Finally, sieve the sample and report the percents passing to the nearest whole number except for the number 200 sieve, which is reported to the nearest tenth of a percent. Please visit our website at cttp.org for other training videos and modules.